For a performer, it's always the gift to be able to show as much as possible of a character. And of course, in this piece, I get to show Oedipus from when he's a young man and then all the way up till his death as a fairly old and fairly sick and blind man. And that is, of course, a huge challenge, but also quite simply fun to do, even if it's such a tragic story. Inescu was a very famous violinist, he was a very famous conductor, and he was a musician himself. And I feel that in the way he writes. I also feel in his music that he has taken inspiration from many other composers. I would say that it's a mixture of late Romanticism and Modernism, but basically he's standing on the shoulders of the Romanticists before him. This story is a very good basis for an opera libretto. Most often a good opera libretto has a simple basic story with complicated characters and complicated psychology, because that's what music is so good at describing what we can't grasp, the unconscious, what's going on behind it all, the emotions behind it all. That's where the music kicks in. He killed his father. He had children with his mother. The terrible things that he feared, they happened. Why is he then in the end actually happy? And I think it's quite clear. He's happy because he's come to terms with what happened. He has found out that that's who he was. That's what his life was going to be. 